So, uh, J.W. Dillinger says, would you guys ever uh, consider doing a crossover with other zombie media, like clothing options for The Walking Dead or Resident Evil? Uh, so a lot of that, if we were to do it, it would require, you know, a, a lot of businesses uh, at the business level to sort of shake hands above our heads. And so that's not the kind of thing that we can just sort of come up with on our own and decide to make happen uh, at, at the level of just being on the team, uh, like the four of us. Um, the thing is, like, we already kind of, you know, because our game is such a sort of like broad, middle of the road representation of zombie apocalypse, it's full of nods to all kinds of different zombie media kind of already I, th I feel like you know we don't necessarily need to go hyper specific in representing one particular thing in order for for those to, to sort of feel like you've kind of got the uh the vibe <laughs> of a lot of these other uh, zombie franchises influencing us in one way or another and you can see our love of a lot of the uh, of, of zombie media in sort of the way we work Easter eggs and stuff into the game. Uh, we're actually going to be doing a, a, a sort of a movie night as a studio uh, this week. Where we're going to be watching Zombieland, which is actually one of the original inspirations for the game. Uh, so the last Sith Master wants to know if we will ever add the Walking Dead characters to State of Decay's uh, to any State of Decay game in the franchise. I personally doubt it. I mean, you never know what deals companies will make with each other, and that's the kind of where those sorts of deals happen. I think we're trying to create our own zombie universe. We've got our own rules, our own freaks, our own sort of like uh, mechanics for how the disease works. And so I don't, I don't think we'd be very likely to try to merge with that with The Walking Dead. They've got their own zombies and their own rules. And I think it would be kind of strange if their character showed up in our world. We, we need to create our own characters. We need to make it be our own ownable IP. We don't want to just be like, like we want to sort of hit the sweet spot in the middle of many different uh, zombie stories so that people feel like they can act out their favorite zombie story in our world. But at the same time, we also want our world to be distinct and be like, oh, this is the State of Decay world. You can tell because of this, that, and the other that's distinctive about this world. And because we are trying to do that, we've got things like Plague Hearts and stuff like that. It, it makes us incompatible with other, with other uh, zombie IPs. Thanks for watching. For mods, weapons, heroes, and more, check out the link in the description down below. I'll see you in the next one.